Whether complimenting a meal, relaxing, or entertaining, cocktails and spirits can spark your dining and social experiences. Join celebrity tastemakers beyond the bar as we mix this week's liquid recipe for the sip. I'm Caitlin Monty, Beyond the Bar, with Alex Muzikidis from Handcraft in New York City, who's mixing up a drink that was traditionally made with cognac and has since changed, but we're going old school with it. We're taking it back and making a traditional Sazerac with Hennessy VS. Where do we start? Four dashes of Peychaud bitters, quarter ounce simple syrup, two and a half ounces of Hennessy VS, add a scoop of ice, stir for approximately 15 seconds, Strain into a chilled double old-fashioned glass coated with absinthe. Coated with absinthe? That's the fun part. Express the oils from the lemon zest on top of the cocktail. Rub the lemon zest around the rim and then discard it. What should I expect? And I'll admit, I've never had absinthe. It's almost like licorice. Ooh. Definitely a spirit forward drink. Well, it has been around for 150 years. They knew what was good then, still good today. Exactly. Classic cocktails like the Sazerac are back in style. This reminds me of Manhattan. It's actually technically more like an old fashioned because you have a little sugar in there, bitters, and then the only difference is the absinthe. As a bartender, are you impressed with people who know to order a Sazerac with Hennessy? It usually stops me in my tracks. And this drink has roots in the South. It was originally invented in New Orleans by one Thomas Handy. As the story goes, he divulged the recipe right before his death, and... It was his dying wish for us all to drink Cesarex? Apparently. This is a fine gift from Mr. Handy and a fine cocktail made by you, so thank you and cheers. Thank you so much. To learn more about making a Cesarex old school with Hennessy, visit CelebrityTasteMakers.com. Plus, you'll find events, updates, even giveaways that take you beyond the bar. Until next time, I'm Caitlin Monty. Here's to you.